you watch the, you watch the first video from the beginning, you will understand this car right. Now, in Ghana, yeah, they have it. They have it in Ghana. You see how everything look like. Hmm? It's in Ghana. Look at that. The latest test uh, cyber truck in town. Yeah. Hey. The rich man. Or do you wish me well, a penny for your tough, but see no chain. Snap for the sun like Diddy. The rich got a mad ass son, I'm like Billy. I ain't never switch up. Whole team with me. Put known for my city like. Hey. So after this Jarvis Ben saga. Ghanaians are now seeing the real Odogus in the country. It, it has become like a norm, as if it's written in the constitution that everybody has to start showcasing his or her properties, the kind of things they have. Hey, I am not understanding this, though, because initially we don't used to see this type of cars, even though we see, we see cars, but not this type of cars on the streets of Ghana. Bah, this time around, dear. Hey, the street of Ghana is speaking luxury, luxury. This is Authentic Plus TV. My name is Sarah Tete. Kindly do subscribe, share, and like. Also, don't forget to follow us on all social media platforms. All right, let's see this set of cars owned by Ghanaians in the country. It was customized from, you know, the company and it was shipped to ghana right over here the electronic you know bugatti that you can see right over here is dr osekom despite and dr for Sapon, you know cruising in this wonderful car most of the cars that you can see parked right over here is you know it belongs to dr osekom despite and you know his brother and we are going to explore some of the wonderful cars that this you know rich people are cruising in it right over here and i can tell you that when you see these cars you will know that yes money day ghana sika el ghana sika el fee so this is you know the j wagon 20 yes you know the j wagon 2020 yes this is what you're seeing right over here belonging to doctors that come despite and as you can see in some you know other wonderful cars you can see the Bentley, the J Wagon, you know, the Rolls Royce and other stars. Some of them are belonging to this, you know, wonderful, you know, rich men. Yes, I can see Toro, you know, cars right there. So it's ranges, you know, 18, they bought cars, 17, they bought cars, 16, they bought cars. Wow. So look, right there is the Corvette in the morning. I had some stuff going on, wanting to arrange this whole place. So um, I literally just went to park the Corvette there, but I'm just going to move it here before um, I show you guys the whole about the Tesla. I parked it in my neighbor's house, but let me just move it and bring it here first. See, the, the, the Corvette has like the craziest loud sound that I love, right? Come, let me give you like that early morning push to start vibe here. The moment I just press this two button, right, it's just fine. When I see him, so all these cars were in the country, but no one knew about it. No one. Even if most people know, not everybody. But then after this Ben saga, hey, Ghanaian streets. Wait, oh, 
So, una de all, all this. But secrets, in, in the secrets, wow. I earlier saw Kwame Despite's own showcasing his properties, the kind of cars he has. I decided not to talk about it because who, who doesn't know Kwame Despite? If we talk of Kwame or say Despite, most people know him. Everybody, everybody knows him. So I decided not to talk about it. But after his own, then I saw other people, other people's own. I was like, oh, really? So it has become like a norm. Wow. Let's look at another set of cars. Let's video from the beginning. You will understand this car, right? Now, in Ghana, yeah, they have it. They have it in Ghana. You see how everything look like. Hmm? It's in Ghana. Look at that. Look. Ghanaians have all this thing. Do you see? Please. When you, you are in Nigerians or whoever you is, please, when you come to Ghana, please respect their also. All this thing, they have it. And uh, if they eat it, it is 90s. They have the cars here. They are not bragging with anybody. They are not like... Now we are showing you what Ghana have that no even... <laughs> These are also cars in Ghana, not US, not anywhere, not in Nigeria, but in Ghana. And these people are Ghanaians. These people are Ghanaians. So until you touch someone, you wouldn't know the real character of the person. That is it. That is what I am understanding in this, in this whole thing. Because if this Ben Saga didn't come, uh, come out and all that, I don't think people will be willing to start showcasing their properties. Do you get it? So until you touch someone, you wouldn't know whom the person is. So don't judge the book by its cover. And I want to throw a challenge to you. Get me the name of these Ghanaians under my Ghanaians owing this cast under my comment section. And if you are correct, there is another update, and I'm going to give you a shout out. This is Authentic Plus TV. Don't forget to please subscribe to the channel. Follow us on all social media platforms.